COVID-19 is caused by a coronavirus. Antibiotics help treat bacterial infections, but may harm beneficial bacteria and cause side effects. Antibiotics are ineffective against viruses, including coronavirus, and healthcare professionals aim to minimise antibiotic use. Some COVID-19 patients have bacterial co-infections, but identifying who would benefit from antibiotic treatment can be challenging. A blood test called procalcitonin or PCT can help diagnose if bacterial infections are present. The PEACH study investigated the relationship between PCT use and antibiotic prescribing in hospitals in England and Wales during the first wave of the pandemic. This study analysed qualitative and quantitative data sources. They found that initially, antibiotics were prescribed for patients with COVID-19 pneumonia based on concerns about bacterial co-infections. The number of hospitals using PCT rose from 11% to 51% in emergency or acute admissions and from 48% to 84% in intensive care units. Analyzing hospital data, introducing PCT testing in emergency departments and acute medical admission units was linked to reduced antibiotic prescribing. This effect lessened over time. PCT didn't change antibiotic prescribing in ICU settings. Over time, clinicians gained confidence in their ability to distinguish between symptoms caused by COVID-19 and bacterial co-infections. Antibiotic prescribing decisions were influenced by clinician experience, confidence, senior support, situational factors and organisational influences. Researchers developed a model to understand decision-making around antibiotic prescribing and help plan antimicrobial stewardship support for pandemics. Retrospective patient-level data analysis found that PCT testing was associated with reduced antibiotic prescribing, with no increase in mortality or length of stay in hospital, and was cost-effective.